Tukia na kogi Yari yote. Yari imekuwa revoked. Eh, si imeshaandikwa back through na nafaa kuja kuichukua sasa. Mm. Eh, official. Eh? Hadi tayari. Ah. Kupa hata. Sasa kama ndio wa revoked moleo eh. Na ndio na ndio hiyo tagari. Oya ni mwe kuweka hadi. Tayari. Okay. <laughs> A livestock and agricultural research organization, CALRO in short. The milestone that we have achieved today as we speak to you is that we have made a recovery of 825.65 hectares of land for the research from various individuals. That land is worth 8.67 billion shillings. And uh, the achievements has been achieved through various uh, two strategies. One is that where we had alternative dispute reconciliation, where certain individuals who had taken the land illegally in around 1997 uh, returned the land to uh, the government of Kenya. Uh, and in that aspect we recovered um, 400 uh, acres. That was about 57.7 uh, uh, hectares. That was the first instance, and in addition to that, we used a strategy where we worked with other government agencies, including the National Land Commission and the Ministry of Lands, where through a gazette notice, we revoked illegally acquired titles for land, uh, measuring uh, about uh, 700 Seven hundred and if you do the quick mathematics, seven hundred and uh, uh, fifty, uh, and uh, returned that land to Calro. Today we have made vi uh, visit site visits, as you know, and you have seen the extent of that uh, land in which we have we had been able to recover for uh, the government of Kenya. Uh, in addition to that, for the physical year, uh, which is uh, 2019, uh, we have been able to recover also 
37 houses, government houses, that had been illegally, illegally acquired uh, by uh, grabbers. Uh, and those houses are worth 157 million shillings. And they are located within the CBD of uh, Nakoro. We also had, uh, a part of that is also, uh, we recovered, survey uh, ha camp houses, which was low level uh, grade houses for the workers of the survey, which was also acquired by, uh, which was also acquired uh, uh, through a court order. Uh, we went to court 11 years ago and we, we were able to get back that land. It is part of the 27 houses that I've talked about. These houses are houses for the Ministry of Housing and also uh, Interior uh, Ministry, where uh, a Deputy County Commissioner's house uh, was also illegally grabbed. Further to that, the Commission has also targeted uh, another county in Bomet and uh, recovered uh, five parcels of land for a stadium worth 11.9 uh, million shillings. And we are set to return all these properties to the entities that are custodians of these uh, parcels through a ceremony that is to be defined later a handing over ceremony which will be conducted. Thank you so much. But the other uh, cases which we have not yet concluded and uh, we are not saying that we have recovered but there are processes within court. We have government houses which is bef uh, 25 of them in Nakuru CBD uh, which is before court. The others in Baringo that we are pursuing to, to recover uh, through uh, various strategies again, which are under investigations, uh, there is uh, the uh, the farm that is along uh, Mahimai Road, uh, quarantine farm, uh, what they call it from the cultural language, uh, that we are also pursuing a negotiated settlement, and we are engaging uh, the, the the people, but there are other encumbrances on it so far. I think they have ripped the investments they have made on this land for the period they have been using. But we will give them an opportunity. Uh, they have been given opportunity already through the government notice, uh, gazette notice, and they have been asked to come forward, which they have not. And that's why the government took the action of the revocation of the titles and actually the processing of the new titles. But still, we are open uh, to have uh, when the entity receives the land, Caldro and other government agencies concerned will be able to have discussions with them. So Whichever way, through eviction or whatever, or, or, or other modalities, yeah, where they pay rent to the entities that are concerned. It is an open thing, but it depends how they come forward. Yeah. The, the LR numbers for uh, Naivasha uh, Land is 52 Tolo, uh, which is uh, 400.2 uh, hectares. Uh, we have uh, 5211 uh, stroke 1, 200, 220, uh, 222.7 hectares. We have uh, 5211 uh, stroke. Seven, uh, stroke, stroke two, uh, which is uh, 157 hectares, and uh, we have uh, 5211 stroke seven, which is 56.7 hectares.